Losing files from an SD card is frustrating. Whether it's photos from a once-in-a-lifetime trip, videos from a project, or crucial work documents, losing data feels like a disaster. But don't stress, Mac has powerful recovery options that most people don't know about. Today, I'll show you five proven ways to recover deleted files from an SD card. Some take seconds, others go deeper into the SD card's memory. Before we start, have you ever lost files on an SD card? Drop yes or no in the comments. Let's see how common this nightmare really is. First things first, Mac has a safety net. If you deleted the files on your Mac while the SD card was connected, check the trash. But if you deleted them on a camera or other device, this won't work. Open trash and search for your files. Right and click, put back to restore them. If your SD card has a recently deleted folder, some cameras create this, check there too. If they're here, congrats, you're done. But if not, don't worry, we're just getting started. Most people think Time Machine only backs up the Mac itself, but if you had your SD card connected when a backup was made, your files might still be there. Here are the steps. Connect your Time Machine backup drive. Open Time Machine. Navigate to the date before deletion. Restore your SD card files. No backup? It's okay, because method three is where things get serious. Sometimes files aren't deleted, they just vanish. They might be hidden or corrupted, but terminal can help. Meesters. Here are the steps. Open terminal, command plus space, search terminal. Type this. If files show up, move them back to your Mac manually. If your SD card is corrupted, try this. If this worked, great. If not, we need something stronger. If your files are completely erased and nothing else has worked, recovery software is your best bet. There are tons of options, but the most reliable ones for Mac are Disk Drill, paid but powerful. Photo Rec, free and open source. EaseOS Data Recovery, user friendly. Here are the steps. Download a recovery tool. Select your SD card, scan for deleted files. Recover files to a different location, not the SD card, to avoid overwriting. Most people stop here, but there's one last method that can bring back files even when software fails. If your SD card is physically damaged, meaning it doesn't even show up on your Mac, no software will work, but all hope isn't lost. If your SD card is readable, but files are gone, professional software is the best option. If your SD card isn't even detected, recovery labs can physically extract data. This can cost between $100 to $1,000, so it's a last resort. Hopefully you don't need this step. Alright, we covered a lot, from simple fixes like checking trash to powerful recovery software and even professional data recovery. But here's the deal, the best way to avoid this nightmare again is to be prepared. Um, quick pro tips to keep your SD card safe. Always eject properly, don't just pull it out. Use high quality SD cards, cheap ones fail faster. Now here's something interesting, if you ever had an SD card completely fail on you, drop a comment below with what happened. I'm curious, what's the worst SD card disaster you faced? Stay safe and I'll see you in the next one.